Hey friends, I hope you're doing well. I just wanted to hop on and do a quick video because I've had a number of people asking me about if I'll be at G-Fest this year. And I think that this warrants doing a video so I can elaborate on it a little bit. But the truth is, I've been attending G-Fest pretty regularly since 2018. Megumi Odaka being a guest that year kind of like was the thing that drew me back into G-Fest. And of, of course, excluding the pandemic because G-Fest didn't happen, I've been attending very regularly. And the truth is, G-Fest 2022 last year was one of my favorite G-Fests because I basically just got to spend the, the time I was there just hanging out with friends doing videos together, like just really bonding with these phenomenal human beings that I've known online for a very long time. And, and honestly, it was the highlight of 2022 for me. And I was really looking forward to this happening again this year. However, being that my fiance and I just bought a house around Christmas and being that we just got engaged, we have to be a bit financially conscious this year. And with that being said, I've unfortunately made the difficult decision that I will not be attending G-Fest for 2023. I'm a bit devastated about it because one, I wanted to see my friends again and, you know, spend time with them again. Two, I wanted to meet Yumiko Shaku because she's one of my favorite actresses. She plays Akane from the Kiru Saga and up there with Mugumi Odaka, she's one of my favorite actresses. I'm really devastated about that. Uh, I literally cried about it the other day. But and number three, I've been offered like two or three panels to, to participate on panels this year, which I've not done in a long time. And I was really, really excited about it. I, I was invited to be on the Kaiju Writers panel. like, And I just, I'm, I'm really craving that level of engagement at G-Fest. And the fact that I had to say no, like kind of destroyed me a little bit. But again, like, I have to be financially conscious and hopefully future opportunities will present themselves at G-Fest because I do plan on going next year. Now, like being that I don't live super far from Chicago, I could easily, I could probably pull off attending for like a day. However, last year, that's kind of what I did due to financial situations. And I just, I didn't feel like I got to really soak in and, and like absorb G-Fest. I got to hang out with friends it was great, but it felt like really rushed. And next year, I would ideally like to spend more than a day and a half. Like, I want to spend like a couple of days, maybe the whole weekend at G-Fest. That way, it's not just like this rush. And then I have to spend like eight hours driving home, right? So, like, I'm hoping to save up and, and be able to attend next year. And being that next year is going to be another Godzilla anniversary year is going to be a big year anyway. So... So yeah, like to my friends, I am very sorry that I will be going. Uh, however, I will be living vicariously through you. So please send me photos, etc., video, all of that. And for those of you who were looking toward, or forward to Godzilla content for, from me for G-Fest, I won't be providing G-Fest content, obviously. However, I will have two episodes of Growing Up with Godzilla premiering throughout the month of July. So please tune in for that. Thank you again for supporting my show, Growing Up With Godzilla. It means a lot to me because I, I, it's been such an enriching experience. And I was hoping this year to actually have a Growing Up With Godzilla panel at G-Fest. However, because of this, it did not pan out. And I, I do think, though, that that could be on the horizon for the future. So maybe next year. But I just wanted to hop on and do a video about this. I hope that you all understand. I love you. Subscribe. Click like. Watch Growing Up with Godzilla, please, um, if you haven't. And again, thank you for all the support. For those of you going to G-Fest this year, I hope that you have a phenomenal time. I'll talk to you soon.